breaking news again. Back to back days. The Kansas City Royals go out and they go sign a guy, Michael A. Taylor, outfielder formerly on the Washington Nationals. Uh, Michael Taylor, uh, Michael A. Taylor, excuse me. Uh, he's not uh, a big bat. Um, his best season was in 2017, where he, um, he had about 400 at-bats at 270, or like 50 RBIs. Um, but this last season, he um, had a below a 200 uh, batting average. He hit 196, um, which is not good at all. Last um, 2019, though, he did have an all right year again, only getting he's getting 88 at bats. But he's had an injury played career, but he's proven he is clutch. But personally, I don't think um, for the Royals, this is gonna like you see Alex Gordon retires and they need to go out and get an outfielder. But I like their outfield depth, I like the prospects they have in the outfield. I think Michael A. Taylor kind of reminds me of like a John Jay who they signed in 2018, he was there till about um, June. Um, maybe July, and um, he was traded away. He got some pieces. He got um, some prospects that you can develop. I think that's what Michael A. Taylor is going to be. I think he's just going to be a guy. He's going to step in. He's going to play about 50 games maybe, and he's going to get traded off. He's going to get shipped off. But, yeah, uh, Michael A. Taylor signed with the Kansas City Royals. Not big news, but it's something. Um, thank you guys for watching. Please like and subscribe. We are Built Better.